Hey guys, Brandon here, coming at you with another MLB The Show video. Today, uh, as you can see over here, we have on the 17th a roster update. So today is going to be my prediction video. Uh, compared to the last one, I put a little bit more planning and stuff into it. And if you peep the right-hand corner, you'll see that I sold all my players. So now I have 312,000 stubs. I'm trying to be the first free-to-play player to make a million. We'll see how that works. Uh, stub making method coming soon, so don't worry about that. But today, roster update video. See if uh, you guys want to invest in any of these players who might go up or down. Not necessarily invest in the people who are going to go down, but get rid of them if you're trying to do like completion sets and stuff like that. Just because like, if they're gold and they went down, it'd be like, oh, awesome, they're a thousand stubs, but... uh. If they go down, they'll only be worth like 300 or something. So it'll be a nice little way to save money or if you have a bunch of them uh, and you need to get rid of some of them because they're about to go down, I would do that. So I did focus on some of like the downgrades and upgrades because most people don't care about uh, showing people the downgrades and stuff like that. But I figured I'd be a little different. So let's jump into it. Probably could have just did the main menu, but I enjoy Diamond Dynasty, so... So we'll start with the upgrades. Uh, I didn't do any of them to the bronze because obviously they're not that expensive anyways. But to the silver, uh, so they're going to be guys going from bronze to silver. First guy we have is going to be Mitch Moreland. Uh, he's one point away from being a silver. I could see him go in there. Uh, he's already decently expensive, so people have already kind of caught on that, you know, he only needs one point to go silver. Uh, so he's only batting 231 this year, but uh, he does have 12 home runs, so I could see the power versus lefty going up, and that's all he's really going to need. Uh, so, yeah, Mitch Moreland, number one, I think he might be going silver. And then we got Rafael Devers. People are on this one more than that Mitch Moreland, so uh, he's obviously going silver, even though it's three away. He's got a 336 average. He's only got two home runs, so not sure about the power on that, but uh, he does have five stolen bases, so I think his speed might be upgraded. You never know, though. Five stolen bases, 53 speed. It's close, but not there, but the stealing stat of only 11, it's not quite there. So I think Rafael Devers will be going to silver. Next player we got... Robinson Chirinos. He's another guy that's one point away. With Robinson Chirinos, he's only hitting 278, which I say only, but it's really not that bad. He does have six home runs. So I I could see him going up just that one point to being uh, a silver. It really doesn't take much to get that one point. So I could see them upgrading his vision or maybe contact right, or I could see them doing one of those for just one point for him. Next we have... Hunter Pence. Obviously, not many people have caught on to this one, but I could see it going well for him. He's hitting 316 with seven home runs. Seven home runs really doesn't uh, reflect those power stats yet, uh, so I could really see Hunter Pence going silver. He's three points away as well as the other one, but three points really isn't that much when his hitting should be really upgraded. Right now he's only a bronze hitter, but uh, he's hitting like more than a bronze hitter to me. So if you want to invest in some Hunter Pences... Could be a smart move. And then for my first hitter and last player of bronze to silver. We have Lou Weaver. Don't know why I went in here. Uh, oh, awesome. So Luke Weaver is 3-1, which is a good record with a 2.98 ERA. Uh, I don't really remember seeing... Uh, I didn't see what overall he was. Oh, just one point away. So Luke Weaver from bronze to silver with a 3-1 and one record, 2.98 ERA. Uh, I think we could really see him going up a little, just at least 275. 
So then we'll head up to the people who are silvers and who should be going gold. I don't know, I went for him first. Uh, so the first person I have on this list, Josh Bell. Josh Bell, uh, so he is four points away. But hear me out. Uh, 324, 10 home runs. Uh, 10 home runs, he deserves some more power. He's hitting 324, like I said. So vision and contact can be there, and I don't see... Uh, he could go up this update. I don't necessarily not see him going up this update. Maybe not all the way to 80, but most people only tell you the people that they think are going to go this update, so they'll focus on like one or two. But if you can start buying these in bulk and then uh, he continues his streak, you can really get rid of them for a lot of money. You buy 10 of these at 660, and then you have 6,000 spent. You send it, and then uh, you get 10,000. Uh, later on, that means 4,000 profit off that just for buying these cards and selling them back whenever he goes gold. And that's the base stat for 1,000 each. So, uh, yeah, getting this Josh Bell before he does any better. 10 home runs, 324. I don't really see him slowing down. He's doing even better as of lately. And so the last one's going to gold for me. Uh, also a pitcher. Not also, as in, like, he was a pitcher. The other guy had a pitcher. Caleb Smith. Caleb Smith, three off, but uh, being a Miami Marlin, uh, he has a 3-0 and record with a 2.11 ERA. I think that's deserving of a gold. Uh, he hasn't been walking people. He hasn't been giving up as many home runs as most. It's 3-0, and 2.11 ERA, you can obviously tell. Uh Buy a lot for six fifty, sell them for a thousand whenever he goes gold. Sell them for a thousand two hundred, whatever it's actually going to land at, and uh, you'll have some good money off these. And now what everybody's here for is the golds to diamonds. Uh, some of these should come as no surprise, but uh, got George Springer. George Springer, uh, he's three off. Uh, it's kind of hard to go up three as a gold, but uh, I feel like he could do it. Right now, he's one of the hottest people in the league at 323 batting average as a leadoff hitter, 15 home runs as a leadoff hitter. His power versus righty could go up. His vision can go up. Uh, he's been playing good defense, so I don't see why his fielding can't go up. So I could see him going up to an 85 overall or... In like a future update, he goes up to an 85 overall, and you make some money off him because 5,000 is the base stat for him. Most people sit around 10,000, like that Cody Bellinger. If you bought a lot of him, uh, you, you done messed up because he was already at 15,000 or whatever, and he actually went down when he got to diamond because everybody was buying him. Everybody and his their mom, like everybody knew he was going up. It was such a stupid move. I mean, I didn't do any, but. Oh, it's because it's not Ozuna. <laughs> Roberto Osuna. Roberto Osuna. So he's another one that's uh, three away. It's kind of hard for closing pitchers to get there just because they don't have the stamina to get there. Like, you can tell all of his stats are super good, but, uh, you know, just because his stamina is low, it's hard to get him to diamond. So... Roberto Zuna, 2-0. Osuna, 2-0. Uh, 10 for 10 on save opportunities and a .52 ERA. That is dominant. Uh, he might not go up this update, but like I said, invest in a couple of these. He goes diamond, 10,000 minimum. If you got a lot of these, like it's game over if he goes diamond. Uh, you're making so much money, you don't know what to do with it. Obviously, you do know what to do with it, but... Uh, you don't know what to do with it. So that's the end of my upgrades. Uh, if you do want to stick around for the downgrades, the only people I have going down are actually uh, silvers going to bronze that you might want to let go of real quick. Uh, if you don't want to tune in, that's fine. Uh, I'll catch you guys in the next video. And uh, thank you for watching. Consider subscribing if you want stub making methods or any more videos. Leave those in the comments below. And uh, if you're going to stay, we're going silver to bronze downgrades. So we got, uh, 
somebody who was pretty hyped coming in, but didn't quite pan out, Miguel Andujar. Uh, so with him, he is hitting 128. 128 and you're a silver, your contact's going down, your vision's going down, you're you're not staying in silver. You could easily see a three-point drop to make you a, I think 75 still silver, so I think a four-point drop to make you a 74. Uh, I could see it happening, hitting a measly 128. I don't think you deserve to stay up here. Uh, and then somebody who pains me to do this. Harrison Bader, Harrison Bader from the Cardinals, so he's hitting 200, there's not much that they can take him down on, but uh, if you're waiting on trying to see if he'll go down, uh, there's a chance I could see him going down just because he's only hitting 200 and it's kind of rough for him right now, so that's all I have to say about him. We got another silver in Travis Shaw. Travis Shaw, big power bat. Uh, only issue is he's hitting 163 with only four home runs. If you only have four home runs, you're not deserving of 86 power. You're only hitting 163. You're getting your contact revoked a little. You're getting your vision revoked a little. It'd just be a rough time to keep him as a silver, so I could see him going down. And then one, gr one downgraded pitcher I could think of... Uh, Joe Musgrove, uh, he's got good stats, but his stats don't show it in real life. He's 1-4 and four with a 4.20 ERA. Uh, I could see him going down to a bronze or coming soon just because when it rains, it falls with players that are going to be coming fast. Some honorable mentions for some players that I would wait for. Uh, what I'm currently waiting for is... Uh, It's hard to say that they're going to go down, but Andrew Miller, he's one point away from going down. Uh, this is what I'm waiting for to complete the Cardinals set. I don't think Andrew Miller is going to stay a diamond. And if you think I'm buying him for 26000 just for him to go back down to 1000 stubs, you're wrong. <laughs> That's going to be the biggest downgrade in history. He's not doing too well right now, uh, so I would wait for him. And uh, with that honorable mention, that will wrap up uh, my video. So if you guys do want to see anything else, just consider subscribing. And uh, let me know if you want any more stub making videos. Those are coming as, they, as I can get them out. Uh, but besides that, let me know if you want to see any other kind of videos. Uh, if you didn't watch my last video and you do want to join my MLB The Show tournament, uh, you can go back to that video and watch. Uh, or you can just friend request Brandon Luttrell. And... Uh, Send me a message on PlayStation that you want to be in, and I'll let you in. Uh, that's going to come up pretty soon, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll catch you in the next video. See ya.